Quick question, what exactly is a town hall for? Well, put simply, it's used for the headquarters of local council and administration. Uh, government affairs carried out there, meetings, etc, everything like that. So why on earth is there a cannon outside this one? Well, Rotherham was renowned for its industry. First it was coal mining, but before that it was steel, and before that, iron. In fact, in the 1700s, the local Walker family of Masborough had an iron empire that spanned the world. They made iron from everything from bridges in London to cannons for the Royal Navy. They made 79 out of 105 cannons for the HMS Victory. And this one in particular, built between 1790 and 1820, was actually used in the tremendous victory against Napoleon in the 1805 Battle of Trafalgar. Rotherham played a historic part in global events but it was also affected by national ones. In 1972, Parliament brought in the Local Government Act. Now, this affected Rotherham only by making it a metropolitan borough, which it still remains today. And that just meant it grant was granted royal charters. The town hall, however, had to be done up. The old one was on Howard Street, and it simply was not suitable for all the new administration affairs that would have been carried out. And so it was brought here to the Cross. Now the Cross is an historic location in Rotherham's heritage. This used to be where the old cattle market was carried out, which was renowned as one of the biggest in the region until it was eclipsed by Sheffield. This building, however, had not always been a town hall. It was originally built only in the 1920s, making it one of the younger buildings around here. And it used to serve a much different purpose. It actually was the courthouse, the West Riding Courthouse, as it was known. Now, again, they needed a bigger courthouse, and so operations were moved to a different location. However, when the building became vacant in the 1990s, they realised that this building was perfect for the local government, and so it became the town hall they were all familiar with today.